World Trade Center in Pasay City where there's an auto show going on and the Suzuki Cup trophy will be at the Suzuki and I've been told that the Astros will be raising the event as well so go check it out. Hi, um, you're an Ascal fan, right? Yes, I, am. I can see it in your um, garb. How excited are you to see the Suzuki Cup trophy? Super excited. Uh, but sadly, I can't go to Panad because my cousins are coming this uh, November. But I'm very excited. I uh, hope to. I will get this cup this time. And uh, all my well wishes are for the national team, Team Alaska. Alright, um, are you upbeat and um, positive that the Suzuki Cup trophy will find the Philippines its home for the next two years? Of course, of course, of course. Uh, is there any message that you want to send to the Ascals? Now that the Suzuki Cup is just looming around. Um, uh, uh, all I can say is uh, just do your job, do your best, be confident, and do it for our country. We love you, and I love you, Ascals, forever. For being with us here today. But of course, before we start introducing our stars, pag-usapan muna natin ang AFF Suzuki Cup. So just a brief background of what it is. So it is a biannual football competition, meaning it happens once every two years. And of course, it is accredited by the ASEAN Football Federation and by FIFA. So Here's Stefan Schrock of the Ascals. Schrocki, you are sitting beside the Suzuki Cup trophy. How confident are you that we'll have this trophy home with us until for the next two years? I'm very confident that we can make a big mark, a big uh, statement in the Suzuki Cup. And I'm very excited to, to perform and to bring back home or bring home the cup for the first time. Last 2016, we weren't able to get to the semifinals. Yeah. We're going all out this year? Of course. In order to win that cup, we, we want to go all the way to the finals at least. Uh, 2016 is past. There are a lot of things happened, a lot of uh, miscommunications and and unprepared things happen. So this for this time, everything is in order and everything will fall to its right place. I'm here with Manuel Ott. Manny, um, 2016, we weren't able to get to the semifinals of Suzuki Cup. Do you think this year we're going all out? Yeah, I believe so. Um, with the new coach, we're setting new heights. Um, the last two camps were very successful, very exciting. Uh, he has a new passion, uh, getting everyone on the right page. Uh, yeah, we're pretty excited for that tournament and we're definitely looking for a bright come out for this camp. Um, we're playing in Bacolod. Yeah. How excited are you that um, our home game will be played in Panaan? Um, for especially the Cyrus players, it's very exciting because we know that that field because we're playing there a lot of times. Uh, we know the crowd, so it's just like basically a home game for us. Um, but yeah, it's very exciting. The people are very passionate. Uh, they definitely will push us to our limits, and for that support, it's always good to have in our back. So we're pretty excited, and uh, yeah, we're we're definitely ready for that game. One last question. Are you confident that the Suzuki Cup trophy will find Philippines its home for the next two years? I'm definitely confident, but I'm, I'm also like a realist. I don't want to be uh, making predictions too much, but uh, this year there's definitely a very good chance that we can make a good impact on it. And uh, definitely with the points we're setting or the targets we're setting, it's definitely be reachable for this year. They're saying hi. Uh, hopefully, the Suzuki Cup trophy would be home, would find the Philippines its home for the next two years. So, good luck and all the best for the Asmos. Coming to Suzuki Cup, please go go out and cheer for them on the 13th of November in Panahan against Singapore and on the 21st against Thailand. Also in Panahan Park and Stadium. Okay, the Cabo of Ultras Filipinas is Patricia Garcia. Everybody can come and uh, do the 
exciting games. I hope you can cheer us up. Thank you. Thank you. 